Here we are with Dimitri Bivol, night after your Canelo fight. Yeah. How are you? Good, good. <laughs> How do you feel? You just got the biggest win of your career last night. Yeah, it's for yeah, it's biggest fight for me because it's main, a lot of people watch this fight and uh, I was enjoyed when the crowd was lying. You know, it, it's nice. When you look at the the fight overall, like what, was it what you were expecting, or, or was it different than what you expected? Uh, a fight overall? Yeah. Fight. Когда начал? What was it? Yeah. Uh, what do you expect? Uh, uh, I think it's uh, yeah, it's like uh, I expected, but I didn't expect uh, on Canelo with his defense. I I knew he was, he has a good defense, yeah. but. He's much better than I thought. Yeah, he thought. He's much better than you thought. Yeah, yeah. He, his upper body, it's uh, yeah. good. Did you feel that you were just too big for him, too fast, too skillful? Like, what did you, what'd you feel in there when he was hitting you? Uh, uh, I think maybe my plan is better than yeah. his. <laughs> no. Did you think uh, your size played a difference? No. Uh, it, it looks like me bigger, yeah? Yeah, you were bigger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Real yeah. Yeah. In real life, he, 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 <laughs> yeah, but you know, I, I don't know. Maybe I don't think that I'm too biggest. Too big. You're not the yeah. biggest, like yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. On the fight, I, I went uh, around 183 pounds. Mm. You no, know, in the fight, yeah. I was 183 pounds. Big, but I'm yeah. fat. <laughs> <laughs> How does power feel? Yeah, he's strong. Yeah. Of course, yeah. You, he, he, you saw it. He's punch every time hard. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Well, your arm? How is it? Is, is it pretty bruised? Oh wow! Yeah. Oh, damn. How does it feel? I can, you can make one more fight. One more fight? <laughs> <laughs> you know, when you look overall in the fight, uh, Dimitri, when did you feel that you started uh, pulling away from him? Uh, you know, I think uh, maybe I don't feel that I'm. I'm. Я не то что чувствовал, что я иду вперед по очкам. Я просто начал чувствовать, что я контролирую в бой. It wasn't that I was pulling off or something. I, was, I just felt that I controlled the fight, and the fight goes as I want. Did you feel you controlled the fight from the beginning, or did you feel at a certain point that you were in control? Uh, from the beginning, yeah, yeah. I, I think I was controlled. Yes, I didn't, not too much uh, punches in the beginning, but mm -hmm. I see, I, I, I controlled. Yeah, I, I try, I, I study his punches. Mm -hmm. Why did you like? What made you feel that you were in control? Was it that he he was moving back a little bit? Was it that? Uh, you were throwing more than him. Like, what made you feel like, ah, like I got this? No, when you control someone, uh, it's something deep in your <laughs> inside. Yeah, you yeah. you see, you control. You you can move back. You can move forward. You can uh, got the punches how you want. You know. Sometimes, of course, you you missed. Got you got. But uh, most of them, you control. It it means you control. Mm. Uh, did you feel he was getting tired as the fight got on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I felt that he was tired uh, around maybe seven rounds. Yeah, that's what I yeah. noticed. Like he, yeah. And ten rounds he was uh, tired, yeah. yeah. Did you feel it in his punches too? You know, his punches was a little bit uh, uh, slabier, weak, weakest weaker. maybe, yeah. Ah. Weaker, but sometimes he's getting uh, bruised and... and yeah. Hard like in the beginning. When you were going into the 12th round, did you feel like I, I'm, I'm, I won? This is it. Like I'm winning, or yeah, did you feel yeah. it was close? I was feel that uh, I'm winning, and I have to win this round too. 100 percent, I have yeah. to win this round too, to to feel myself. I did, I did everything, mm -hmm. and uh, now it depends not on me. Yeah. <laughs> the judges. Yeah. Speaking of, of that, so the fight's over. I saw you, you're like this, like you felt that you won. Yeah. It's, but it, when they read the scorecards, did you have a worry or did you know like, no, this yeah, is on the one, On one second, I, I saw the one, uh, one, uh, 15, 15, 113. 113. Oh. Yeah, maybe over there. But you did get a little nervous. Uh, it's one second, just one second, <laughs> just one you second. know? Yeah, you know, um, they announced you as the winner. What went on through your mind? How, how was that moment? 
Yeah, it's, it's just I did my job. Mm -hmm. I did what I had to do. Yeah, just like this. You you were very um, like stoic, like not not super like ah, like you you kept a lot of the emotion in. No, I I, I was yelling a little bit <laughs> with my manager. With your manager, yeah. Yeah. Of <laughs> what did uh you know? What did you tell Canelo right after? I said to him, thank you for the fight, you're a great champion. What did he tell you? He said me similar words, I don't remember exactly, yeah, but similar. Yeah. Mm. You know, speaking of the future, do you want the rematch or do you want to go and do other things? Like, Is there a thing in the contract that says a rematch has to happen? Yeah, yeah we, ha we have a rematch in the contract, but not have uh, rules for this rematch, mm. you know. It, I don't know what will be next, I have to talk with my team, with uh, Canelo maybe should uh, think about his uh, performance today and we have to, we uh, have принять сегодняшнюю ночь и обдумать все, что лучше для этого. We just need the time to think about it. Today we have to accept what happened and uh, realize what's going to happen next. We, we have to think about it. Do you think, Canelo, do you think it's like, oh, a two-part question. The rematch, do you feel you do a lot better? Like, how different is a rematch? Like, I would imagine you feel you win, but do you feel you win more clearly? Of course, uh, I think uh, now I know some, something, yeah? Like you know how to fight him now. Uh, yeah, and uh, maybe he feel too, you mm -hmm. know? I don't know what he feel, but I feel too, I can uh, prove. Mm -hmm. I, I, I can uh, do better. What, what do you feel? You can't do better, or was there something that you, you felt that you could I don't want to talk uh, this <laughs> what strategy? I have to do better. You know? It's about strategy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but overall, you felt like you know, nine out of ten performance, ten out of ten performance. Like, how how'd you feel you did? Around seven, eight, maybe wow. from ten. Yeah. Of course, every time you have to be better. Yeah. It's not 100%. Mm -hmm. it, I, I, I had mistakes, I got the punches. Mm -hmm. uh, this? Not? 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 not yeah. Ah. Of um, course. Do you think it's smart for Canelo to go into a rematch or stay I don't at 175? Know. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Like, mm -hmm. uh, a lot of people say that maybe 175 is, is too much for him. Maybe. Yeah. Do you want to go down to get the belt, or you want to stay and maybe face Joe Smith, better be able to get all those belts? Yeah, 168 for all of belts. Of course, it's, it's good. Yeah, it's yeah. good. Why not? Yeah. Wow, yeah? <laughs> yeah. The thing that yeah, well, excuse with the weight just doesn't make sense, because yeah. Dmitry, exactly the same weight. He's, he's not a big guy. He's yeah. not... Zuda or Amiris or those guys who weighs 200 pounds. Dmitry is 185, 188, walk around. So it just doesn't make sense, the, all the weight issues and stuff like that. Dmitry was accepting 168. Yeah, I remember that. He wanted ago. that fight because he wants all the belts. So you can make 168? Yeah, I think yeah. yes, I, yeah. I could. So you, I would imagine that you Maybe could. I could, yeah, you know. Maybe. You don't know, <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's been a while. <laughs> yeah, I have to think about this uh, really... Yeah, really hard. <laughs> yeah, but you know, the 175, it's not a problem for me, you know. Yeah. I don't feel a problem. It's uh, It means maybe I can make a 168. Mm -hmm. You know, before uh, uh, coronavirus, uh, yeah. I, I, I was 100%, I can make, but, yeah, but yeah, uh, yeah. coronavirus gives me more... <laughs> a little bit, of, little that's bit. all of us. Yeah, you know, <laughs> I was sitting at home and <laughs> grazing my fat. <laughs> you know, Dimitri, when you, when you look at the future, I feel you won a lot of fans uh, tomorrow night, that uh, a lot of people saw your, your boxing ability. Uh, what do you want to tell, you know, the, the boxing fans uh, out there uh, for the future in terms of you? Uh, I want to say thank you to all of boxing fans uh, who uh, watched my fights and uh, who believed in me and uh, I want to congratulate everyone who bet on me and uh, earn money, <laughs> you know, and uh, I want to say Как будет не судите типа по медиа? А, don't judge boxers for media stuff, you know? Judge boxings for 
boxing skills. Try to learn boxing skills. Mm -hmm. All right, Dimitri, may maybe 168 or maybe undisputed at 175. We'll see, right? Maybe why? Yeah, all right. Thank you so much, Dimitri. Appreciate it. And congratulations. Yes, thank you. Thank you so much for watching this video. And make sure to subscribe for more videos of your favorite fighters over here on Fight Up TV. And give us a follow online as well at Fight Up TV on Twitter and on Instagram. We appreciate it, guys.